Hey, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I want to show you how you can use Google's Jamboard product even if you don't actually own a Jamboard. And most of us don't because they're ridiculously expensive. So, anyway, go to jamboard.google.com. Of course, be signed into your Google account when you do so. And you can go in and in the bottom right corner, click the New Jam button, and you'll be able to start jam or drawing on your screen. I'm going to move myself over here. And you can see here I can go in and draw my screen. If I need to erase it, I can erase it. There we go. Go back to drawing. Look at some of our different drawing tools. Maybe I want to change out the colors. There we go. And I can put in a little note. And so now I have my text note up there. I want to add a picture. Well, let's go ahead and add a picture of a cat. And we now have our cat picture on the screen. And you can see we can click and drag and move that all around. Right now, if you want to add another page to this, just hit the Add Frame button at the top. Let's change our drawing tool, and we'll change the color again, and we'll go in and do some more drawing like that. Now, if you want to share this with somebody else, give your jam a title. Call it Sample Jam. And hit the Share button. And in the upper right corner, when you hit that share button, you'll be able to invite other people to work on your jam with you. You can see, give them edit rights or viewing rights. Now, let's go back to our jam board home here. And from here, you can Go and download that as a PDF file or open it up again if you want. And of course, you can remove it and rename it as well. There are Jamboard apps for Android and for iOS. So you can jam on your web browser or on those mobile devices as well. And always, if you want more tips and tricks like this, please check out freetechforteachers.com and practicaledtech.com.